Volvo cars have now developed a digital pregnant crash test dummy. The aim being to learn more about the risks to the fetus and the pregnant woman in car accidents. Her purposes for us are number one, to understand what happens to a pregnant woman and her baby during a crash and how they both interact with the safety systems in the car during a crash. Uh, so far, Linda has been used to test uh, the correct placement recommendations uh, of the seatbelt and the results have shown us uh, that recommendations are best. Uh, additionally, our hope is that in the future, uh, Linda or models like Linda uh, will be used for setting the world's first safety requirements for the development of future cars. According to American research, car accidents are the most common reason for pregnant women visiting hospital. For the fetus, car accidents are the principal cause of fatal injuries. Well, I think the, the most important thing to remember is that we know so little about what happens to pregnant women in car accidents. Uh, the information that is available today comes mainly from the United States, and there there are indications that more women actually die in traffic accidents than during complications associated with pregnancy in hospitals. So this is obviously something that is important for us to study closer. Car crashes, uh, potentially, can pose a danger to the baby at all stages of pregnancy. Uh, it's extremely important uh, that the mother protect herself in the best way uh, with the seat belt, for example, because her safety is the first imperative for the babies. Today, the seat belt provides the best protection for pregnant women and their unborn babies, according to Laura Thackeray, safety engineer at Volvo Cars. But it is very much a question of using the seat belt correctly. It's very important that the belt always lay over the shoulder yes. and between the breasts and to the side of the pregnant belly. And very, very important also is that the lat belt is as low as possible under the belly and laying over the pelvic bones. The aim of Volvo Cars research, which is being carried out in collaboration with Sahlgrenska University Hospital in Sweden, is, amongst other things, to discover the best placement for the seatbelt. Volvo Cars have invested a great deal in this project, and researchers are convinced that it is possible to further develop today's safety systems for pregnant women. Well, first of all, we'd like to find out how common it is in our own country, Sweden, but also we would like to find out which uh, injuries the pregnant women sustain during car accidents. Uh, the information available at the moment indicates that it is mostly to do with placenta uh, uh, loosening during uh, the trauma of a traffic accident and also premature contractions, which can lead to the baby being delivered too early.